I don't like it. I don't like it. To my channel i am naturally carlissa and yes i've moved everything in here don't worry about that it's my box of poison and i got all this stuff in here but today based on the title um i was sent some products from dollar curl club uh for to try and they actually show me a lot of love and i have not bought any of their products yet i'm glad that i'm actually able to try them so first and foremost, if you like this video, like and subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Instagram at naturally underscore Carlissa. I have a lot more content on there. I just hit 10K. Yay! Also, if you stick around for the last 20 seconds of this video, YouTube will recommend another one of my videos based on your views. So binge watch me all day. All right, so I'm going to show y'all the products that they actually sent me. All right, so they sent me this revital revitalizing growth oil. Jesus. The Curl Defining Cream, Hydrating Detangling Conditioner, Gentle Plan Shampoo, Leave-In Conditioner, and a Repairing Hair Mask with Green Tea and Shea. So, of course, with these products, we're doing a brrrr. Yes, that was my drum. We're doing a wash and go. So, I've already pre pooped my hair. Let's go ahead with the shampoo. I'm gonna have to, this looks trash. Hold on. This size looks trash too, but oh well. So the shampoo doesn't really have a smell. All right, so it has a nice lather to it. Uh, it is gentle. The name of it is Gentle Cleanse. So it feels like gentle in my hair, feels soft, doesn't feel stripped with this shampoo in it. I'm gonna go wash this out because I think my hair is all shampooed. And my scalp is clean enough and then we'll come back and we'll do the hair mask all right so all this shampoo is out of my hair and my hair feels really soft so i'm gonna go through and split my hair into four sections and then we're gonna put in this hair mask this doesn't have a smell either so i don't think any of these have smells which could be good for people that are sensitive to smells all right oh i just dropped a whole bunch on the floor all right so i'm gonna take this hair mask Till the slip is really good. This water is tearing my eyes up, honey. Okay. All right, so this is to leave on your hair five to seven minutes and then rinse well. For a deeper treatment, cover my hair with a plastic cap and apply moderate heat for 15, 20 minutes. Um, so I think I'm gonna do a combination of both of those. I'm going to put my hair up in a plastic bag, not cap. And I'm gonna put some heat on for seven to 10 minutes because I don't feel like sitting under there for 15, 20 minutes. I'm not gonna lie to you. So I'll be back when this is rinsed. All right, so I left the deep conditioner a little bit in, in longer than expected. I think I did like five minutes with heat and then I ended up doing EC's hair uh, and letting her deep conditioner sit while I did it. So while hers is sitting, I'm going to do my hair. I'm gonna do this wash and go. I'm gonna separate my hair into four sections. And my hair feels really soft. So what I didn't use was the detangling conditioner. Um, complete accident. But I don't really care for leave-in conditioners. I think I said that in the beginning. I thought there wasn't one, but there is one. So next time I'll try to use that. I'm going to use the leave-in conditioner. a scent it's like a it's like a faint okay because i at first i was like you know the only con with these products is there is no smell and i do like a smell in my hair so it does smell good it has like a a, a nice perfume floral scent not too much it smells like lotion and i like the consistency of it it's really thick so i know that my strands are being moisturized all right so boom that's the leave-in conditioner now i'm going to take I'm gonna take this curl defining cream and this doesn't have a smell. So the only thing that has a smell is the leave-in conditioner 
and there's avocado and grapeseed in it. So that's probably what the smell comes from. So I'm gonna take some of this curling cream. Okay, so that's with the curling cream in it. And I'm being really heavy handed with these products. Uh, I think the reason why is because there's no gel. I'm used to a hold. I don't know how these uh, this curling cream is gonna do as far as a hold for my hair. So I'm kind of clumping, clumping my curls up, raking the product through. I wanna air dry for sure. But I think I may um, diffuse a little once it's more dry. Me and diffusing have a love-hate relationship because my hair always comes out frizzy. Maybe, I don't know if it's because it's too hot or I'm doing too much manipulation when I do it, but I'm gonna try my best. And then I'll probably um, go back through and try to stretch this to see how it looks stretched. Now what I would say is after using the deep conditioner, my hair is really dry, but when I put the leave-in conditioner in, it does add the moisture back to my hair. All finished, these are my curls. I'm gonna turn around so y'all can see the back. Uh, let's see some frizz already right here. And that's the thing too, if you can see frizz while you're putting the product in, there's gonna be frizz when it's dry. So this is the back. I don't know what it looks like. If it looks bad, don't tell me. I'll see it. So I'm gonna come back when this is dry. I'm gonna air dry for a while. And then after air drying, I'm going to diffuse. And then if it's too shrunken up, I'm gonna stretch it, but looks good, looks good. All right, so I'll come back with my final results when my hair is dry. All right, so boom, this is my completely dry hair. I'm actually shocked at how much length I retained. From this wash and go, there was no gel and kept my definition. So this is the longest my hair's ever been with a wash and go without me trying to do something. Um, I'm not feeling these frizzy roots though. So that's the only thing that I don't like and I don't know how I'm gonna fix that. I am fine with this uh, flat hair on day one because of the length that I retained. So uh, the shampoo was cool. Um, I didn't do the conditioner. I did the hair mask. The hair mask had a lot of slip. Uh, the leave-in conditioner was very moisturizing and the curling cream was very uh, moisturizing. I don't use a lot of oil, so I did not use the oil in my hair. But what I can say is um, I didn't like that it didn't have a smell. Uh, the only thing that does have a smell is the leave-in conditioner. I kind of like my hair to smell good, so I don't know. But other than that, um, these products did what they said they were going to do and it's the Dollar Curl Club. They were, I think the whole package together is like $36. So that's not bad for five products. Um, next time I will definitely try the, the, the rinse out conditioner with this to see if it makes a difference. But I'm going to have to do something to try to tame this frizz up here because I don't like it. I don't like it. Have you guys tried the Dollar Curl Club products? Do they work out for you? Is it something that's been on your eye? Uh, I'm satisfied. So that's all I got for you people. I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.